Hey everybody, welcome to the 2014 Angler's Choice Marine Open House and we've got new Ranger Pro Skeet Reese with us. Came on board in 2014 from Auburn, but not Alabama, Auburn, California. Skeet, good to yeah. see you. Good and uh, yeah, it's great dealership, good day to day, a lot of, lot of folks excited about fishing in 2014. I know you had a seminar earlier, had a big crowd there, but let's talk quickly about just the transition to Ranger and the classic coming up. I mean, a lot of, there's some change going on, but a lot of good change for you. Well, the one thing you learn is that change is inevitable. And uh, you know, I've been in the industry a long time and, and to be able to come to Ranger is something I, I guess I never saw. You, you can't read into the future and to actually be part of the, you know, the, the Ranger family, as you always hear is like, it's different, but it's 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 a nice welcoming feeling. It's as long as I've been around the fishing industry, I've never been welcomed uh, like the way I've been welcomed now with the Ranger, uh, with the the factory side, the the fans, the boat owners, the dealerships. So it's a it's pretty awesome. I mean, it's it's nice to be welcomed like that. It's like starting over it's like a new kid on the block I'm like, hey it's kind of fun you've been thinking about it and now it's happening well and the next best thing will be winning the 2014 classic in a ranger on gunnersville so let's talk about gunnersville a lake you know well but you know what's it going to fish like in uh, two weeks we were down there last week for the alabama bass trail and it took 32 pounds to win on five fish the qualities there do you expect that to be the case in uh, two weeks uh quality is definitely there lake gunnersville is one of the best lakes in the country and uh, i'm hoping i can I can cram as many five beast into my 521 seed live wells. Um, if it holds about 30 gallons of water. I'm hoping there's only about three gallons left because the rest is all fish. <laughs> that would be a good problem to have. Um, but it's going to be a it's going to be a, a slugfest. It really is. There's going to be a lot of big weights there, and uh, it's going to be a matter of who gets on the right school of fish and with the right technique. And uh, I like the lake. I've done well there in the past. And if it's my time. Uh, I'll, hopefully I'll win. I, I know one thing, they bite, I'm cracking them. Well, I'll tell you, they were biting last week because when we were down there covering the Alabama Bass Trail, fourth place was 26 plus. Big fish was 10 and a half. So it, it was a lot of fun and you could just see the excitement on anglers' faces as they weighed in. I mean, I, I don't know how many bags over 20, but I, I'm guessing 20, 30 bags over 20, 200 uh, boat field. Uh, everybody caught fish and uh, again, 32-1. So, so with you guys out there, expectations are going to be high. That's like talking dirty though to a bass fish when you start talking 10 pounders and, yeah. <laughs> and bags like that. Uh, but that's what I fully expect to see. Um, I figure 27, 28 pounds a day average, we'll have a good shot of winning it. Right. Maybe 25, but uh, we'll see 30 plus pound bags. And uh, if you come in at 20 pounds, you might as well just get in the back of the line because you ain't going to do any good. There you go. Hey, man, great seeing you. Thanks for the time. Best of luck at uh, Gunnersville in two weeks, and congratulations on uh, being a part of the Ranger team. Thank you. It feels good. The Ranger family now.